safe and sound. Hey, lots of toys fans. It's Miriam. Check out this fun new Octonauts we're going to open. It's Quasi and the Volcano Rescue. There's an exploding volcano here. Look at this. It actually has lava that's coming out. And rescue the blowfish and urchin. There's Quasi included and he does have a suit on to protect himself, of course, from the lava. So you press here and the volcano bubbles over. Like this, kid, and be careful. You don't want to see a real volcano. The volcanoes have lava and it's very dangerous. It's as hot as an oven in a lava tube. Yeah, it's probably even hotter, right? Yes, hot as lava. Quasi must race against time to evacuate the blowfish and sea urchin to safety. Stay tuned for our story as we will play with these fun toys. We have lots of other fun Octonauts videos. Be sure to click the I above the informational card to see more videos. But now let's go ahead and open up this fun toy and play with it. And now we have the crab that has to be rescued. Yeah, that's the Yeti crab that goes with this vehicle. Yeah, it goes on top of the vehicle. Look, here's the volcano eruption. Ah. What was that all about? <laughs> you got me, Mr. Urchin. This is to perform rescues in the volcano, right? You don't want to touch it with your arms. You need an extendo grabber. You want to put the little guy inside the volcano? <laughs> Here's everything that's included. Is this, lo is this hot rock? Yeah, that's an extendo grabber to grab all that hot, hot stuff. When the volcano erupts, the fish die. Yeah, if they're not rescued, right? Yeah. But we're going to rescue them. And all, when the volcano erupts, Mine erupted so, so big. That was a big eruption. There's only one rock in Oh no, the volcano's going around. I gotta get out of here. Run for your lives. Quasi will save her. The volcano stopped with the eruption. Yeah. About to erupt. Run for your lives. Don't worry. Get inside here. Okay. I am home. I'm just gonna go. Let's go. Go, Shellington. Go. Here's Quasi, and look at him. He has a firefighting suit on. And this is also a diving suit because a volcano erupts underwater. And he's got this tool here. It's a grabber, so he doesn't have to touch anything, any lava, right? And included in the collection are also three lava rocks. And of course, we have the volcano. I have two very fun toys for you today. The first one is the Gup E and Peso. This is a very fun one. It includes a lot of fun accessories, including Peso. This works in water and you can also play with it on land or in your room. The Gup E is super versatile. You can perform a lot of rescues with it. Place Peso in the Guppy and roll it along the floor for a land rescue. For an undersea mission, place the fish into the vehicle's back hatch and then watch as the guppy sinks to the bottom of the tub and release the fish to safety. We're actually going to try that for you in our bathtub. Mm. 
we've unboxed lots of toys on this channel, including a lot of Octonauts, so be sure to click the I above at the end of our clip to see lots of fun toys and stories about the Octonauts. I'm going to show you the Guppy and Barnacles. Of course, this is part of the Octonauts as well. It works in water, and you launch the Rescue Net. Let's go ahead and take a look at the back. It does include barnacles. Open the dome and put barnacles into his favorite undersea vehicle. Roll the Gupti across the floor and push the fin to launch the rescue net. In water, the Gupti floats and you can connect the air hose to barnacles scuba tank to make him go up and down in the water. It comes with everything you need to explore the incredible undersea world of the Octonauts. The creature actually changed colors in warm water. Here's icy cold water. And look at this. Our creature is back to being purple. In warm water, our creature is actually blue. And in cold water, it becomes purple. And I love the way the Air hose attaches to Captain Barnacle so he can explore and rescue under the waters. So let's go ahead and open them first. We'll start off with the Gup E and Peso. This set looks super fun. This guppy is awesome. It's very spacious. It includes two compartments. There are two areas. You can actually place Pesa right inside. Close the cabin. You can transport passengers in the back. Here's Peppa Pig. She wants to ride with Peso in his guppy. We can fit her right in the passenger spot in the back. Close the cabin, and look at this, Peso is almost ready to take off. The vehicle includes wheels on the bottom. And can you guess what shape this vehicle is in? What shape does it remind you of? I'll give you some clues. There are fins and a tail in the back. And yeah, of course, it's a fish looking vehicle. So it's definitely modeled after a fish really easy to maneuver. There's a place at the top here for this net that belongs with the vehicle. Peso uses it to rescue some fish. Peppa? Yes, Peso? These fish are hurt. We must hurry and take them back to the octopod so I can treat them. Definitely. I'll help. Awesome, let's lift this up and put it in our guppy. There's a handle on the nut here, so you can position it right in here. And this completes the vehicle. It's part of it. Okay, Peppa, we must hurry. These fish are really hurt. Do you want to ride up front with me? Of course, Peso, I would love to. I'll be your navigator. Awesome, let's go. So you can actually fit two figurines in the front cabin. And look at this, the nut fits so neatly inside the goupe or the guppy. The fish that are inside are called the guppies. And you know what? This vehicle automatically releases the guppies in the water. I'm also going to show you the Gup D and Captain Barnacles. He's included. And this is super fun. The creature changes color in warm water. Now let's open this fun toy as well. Oh my goodness, guys, look at this fun collection, including Captain Barnacles and a creature. The Gup D is super fun. Of course, it's also in the shape of a fish. It has wheels at the bottom. 
There's one space for Captain Barnacles to fit right in. His diving suit does not seem to be removable. You actually have to sit him down for him to be able to fit inside. And he fits neatly. There's something fun at the bottom. It's the air hose that Captain Barnacles uses to breathe as he goes to rescue his creatures. It's tucked right in there and it connects to him and it attaches to the Gupti. This way he can safely explore the undersea world and rescue the creature. Here's the creature that's going to change color in water and there's a net included here where you can position the creature right on it. When Barnacles is finished with his mission, he can disconnect his tube, his air hose tube, store it on the bottom. He can also place the nut and the creature right on the goopty. Check out this fun new Octonauts toy. It's a Gup Speeder Speedway. This can hang on your wall. And it does include Captain Barnacles. It's a super fun toy. It does require some assembly. Set off on a high speed adventure with the Octonauts. This wall mounted track system allows you to send your gup speeders racing down the track, speeding past the spinning orcas and narrowly escaping the hungry shark. Here are the speeders you can collect. Speed past the spinning orca. Travel through the squid's tentacle tunnel. Escape the shark's mighty bite and race to the rescue. It says here that it's not a freestanding toy. The playset must be attached to a wall using the 3M command strips, which are included. Now let's go ahead and open it up. Here's everything right out of the package. Let's go ahead and set it up. Here's another piece that connects right here. Look how Captain Barnacles goes. That's so cute. You slip it in. Wow. Yeah, let's finish building this. Too heavy. There's a whale here and some seaweed blocking the way. There's a shark in the way, ready with his teeth out. Watch out, Captain Barnacles, don't get chomped by the shark. And here's the end of our track. It's an octopus with tentacles. And here comes Captain Barnacle with his goop. It has wheels at the bottom and it's a really fun racer. The track is super awesome. You can configure it in different ways. Here's one way we've configured it. The beginning piece of the track mounts on the wall. And that's where you start with your racer. It gets stuck in the first path. It's blocked by some seaweed. Looks like the shark's got him this time.
Hey lots of toys fans, it's Miriam. Check out this fun goop eye we're going to open. It's a new Octonauts toy and it actually includes Shellington. This one works in water or on the ground. Lift and lower the slime rocks to rescue the crab. This looks like an excavator type of an underwater vehicle. And look at this. There's slime included and you get to collect them in a cargo storage. And of course you scoop them up with a scooper. Inspired by the Yeti Crab, the Gupwise long arms make it the ideal vehicle for hauling, lifting, and even scooping up sea goop. Also perfect for bath time missions. The Gup's retractable door safely closes over cargo to prevent it from being swept away. We're going to have a fun mission today. Rescuing the Yeti Crab. What a fun vehicle. I love this claw that actually scoops up just by pushing back this lever. It runs on track, not real track, of course. And look at this. This is where the slime gets stored. And look at this, the top actually lifts up so that it stays opened. And when you're ready to close it, just lift it up and over. There's a seat inside, of course, for Shellington. You can either lift the bed to put him in or you just slide him in. Perfect. He's ready at the controls. This is a perfect pool toy this summer. Look at this Yeti crab. He's quite funny. He looks like a cross between a spider and a crab. And look at these. These are super long. He's inspired by the Yeti. And included in the collection are also three pieces of slime. Check these out. These are fun. Let's go ahead and open the back so we can store the slime inside and how it's supposed to work. It's just supposed to drop them right in there. Needs a little nudge. Doesn't quite go in the compartment. I've only managed to put one in. Because if I fling it, it's actually going to go over, so it doesn't work quite nicely with this compartment here. Let's try it again. Slowly. Oh no! They're actually off my table. It's a fun toy, but practically it doesn't really work how it's supposed to. You're going to have to do it slowly, like I did in here. Whoops, and look at that. Did you notice that? It actually falls right through this compartment. There's a trap here. So you scoop them up. You have to very, very carefully and gently scoop it over. Oh, but not too much. See, not again. So scoop it gently. There we go. And then help it in. Better close my top so they don't fall out. Attention, Shellington. You need to quickly rescue the Yeti crab. He's stuck in slime rock. On my way! Our Yeti is stuck. Will Shellington be able to help him? How 
Howdy matey! What seems to be the problem over here? Look at you, poor little fellow. You're stuck in slime. Eww. But don't worry, I'll rescue you. Otherwise, are you her little crab? There we go. Much better now. I think you're free. Hey, what are you doing, crab? You're not thinking of climbing my vehicle, are you? Come on down, little fellow. This is not for you. What did I say? Hey, come down. I'll take care of you later. I must go pick up the slime and carry it away before anybody else gets trapped. Uh-oh, but there might be a problem. How am I going to open the hatch to store all the slime? Get off, you crab. Aw, oh, better. Are you okay? You seem to be just fine. Stay away now. Go to a safe spot. And there you have it, friends. What an awesome vehicle. It does need your help to operate it and use your imagination to make a really fun story with it. Rescuing the Yeti Crab. That's it for us, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to give it a thumbs up if you like this video. Subscribe and watch more by clicking the I above.